coverage uh, over the uh, bottom side of the map. There's no wards right now. Kuban coming around to flank 13 seconds still until they have LeBlanc. Ooh, they're chunking it down it's pretty quickly. Very low on health. Kickus might not have Smite up in time. They're just burning this thing down. Can they get the battle in time? Smite's up in about four seconds. They're the trying. wave comes in. There's the battle. It's picked up by Kickus without Smite. He got it with the Q and two kills come in. Lublin Shore crushing this battle 2-0 so far. Even despite a 4v5 battle, a third kill, a fourth kill. H2K get crushed it, Baron. They clear that one out himself. Top lane is pushing against Lublin. Big damage though. That is the, that is the non skill shot combo there. He's got to be pretty careful. Life's going back for the up turret. The turret's going to be taking a lot of pain. The Vox's got to be careful. There's the engagement. AOD's AOD's in. Black Shield is on. This could be a very good fight. They set up only Livic. And here comes the battle. Kuban takes a bunch of pain. That is one kill picked up. And here comes the chase. Mockley takes a javelin. Kick the flash in for Odrama. Kick his trains one back. The support's down. But there goes the AD carry. It's a two for one fight. H2K win that. Now Kick has got to be careful. He calls his friend. Over. He's getting oh, crit. he can't get the lantern in time. That is three kills for one. Odrama looks for Livic. He gets some damage down. And here comes he Trashy. The they're gonna get take fun. They're gonna get Livic as well. GA is popped, and this is the chance to push for H2K. H2K, uh -oh. they ace them five for one. The whole point of that entire siege, they went for the turret. A range to wild growth it. And now Dude again gonna get caught out as well. He's gonna try to stay alive. Looks like he will do that just barely, but Alex is oh, he wants the kill anyway. In the middle of the enemy team, uh, a little aggressive there, oh, but the shockwave hits a bunch of people, and Yuki goes down. The dragon form trying to run away, but more damage comes out. Alex Hitch can't quite find another, but Freeze sure will. The ulti. So, you know, stick around. They're gonna try and go for Young, but look at this counter gank from the Copenhagen Wolves is ready. Q is gonna land from Airwax. Will he follow through? Yes, he will. Oh, Kicks nice. him right back into Young, but who's gonna get the slowdown? Intervention used early, but everything. Can they close the game out, or will they step away again? That's a big spear onto Celebi. The rest of Rocket are on the inhibitor. Quick shield on towards him. Oh. He'll in that. He's got the spear. He was caught out. He's only just respawned. Triangle Thorns goes down. Banner is gonna escape this one. Fury wants the chase, but nobody's with him. Fury has to step away. Shepard goes in. He's got the plug on available. Fury, can he land the damage down? No, they're gonna mitigate it very well. Kamashad goes back on. Oh, overpower comes to the side. He just bleeds his way through Gambit, and they just drop like flies. They do manage to get a kill with the <laughs> passive there at the end. But Ryan, but his minions pushing down here. Little minions want to defend the tower for as long as possible. They wouldn't even think Connex is actually sitting behind them. Kevin Zaynard actually getting behind and then King Grinson is! Grinson's gonna go down, but it's a one for one on Pixel now. There is the shutdown. Solar has to flash away. Karnik's coming in too late. Oh, Another binding from Yellow Star will give them a second kill. Such a great play by Zaynard, sacrificing himself just to kick Kreson back into the team. They knew there was no flash on him. There we of course we got in favor of the Copenhagen Wolves, and there's the fish onto the fish. Fish on fish action, and Yero hit with the Q. Is he gonna get away? He is. Oh, he's down. down. He does get the kill in the end. Counts on flashes through. Wow. The shutdown from Mr. Rawls. That's it. When you play Twisted Fate, and when you play Twitch, you need so good synergy. Never mind now, his fight. Oh, yeah, Selfie again gonna have to use the intervention here, and actually a lot of damage going back his way. That's a one kill. Mime and the next target is Cope. Kalsar's going low. Now it's Yero who throws out one. Impaler is there as well. They're trying to finish off Youngbuck, which they'll surely do. And that leaves us with a three on two, this time in favor of the Super Hot crew that come back, and they're not done just yet. Trying to get any more. Mr. Rawls will stealthily work his way forward. That's what the bubble there, trying to speed things up. Does he get the slow? Yes, he did. For new super minions, I think once again, get a fierce. Impaler going in though. Impaler going more towards the front. He wants to cataclysm him down. That's a good side of the wave coming in. And Mima absolutely crapping on them from the back. We'll see the destiny use. Are Red they going to be able to finish up? Kaltar dodges a bit of damage, but he's two coming out now. Make that three for Mima. They're going to chase up this middle lane. The 60 seconds, four timers on the go. They do. Can they get their first dragon? Chop the waters have been thrown out on Froggen already, and that was quickly blocked out. Glacial Fisher on Shook does zero damage. Doesn't cause them towards them. Youngbuck goes aggressive, trying to catch on towards them. Nip is running in. It's a great shackles running in there. They managed to go one for one so far. Both supports going down. Oh, spear dodged out of Froggen kicked in. Kaltar goes on towards him. Intervention being used out. Youngbuck can close the gap on towards him. Great and Goop follows through. Ella oh. goes deep. Flashes back out of there. Youngbuck catches on Froggen. Youngbuck gets one down. Tap is going big on this one. But he's gonna catch on towards it. He gets a double kill in there. They chase him back towards Wicked. Kaltar and Wallach have gotta be careful they don't get pincered by Tabs and Wicked here. They have a lot of damage between them.
And are they going to go for it here with Sultan just checking the brushing? Very, very close encounter. Look at this. Well, that's going back in. Right on top of Wicked. Tom turns around now. Sloan's going to come in. Tom's going to get the double knock. Gets the kill. Who counts on that? And gets the double. Brilliant from Counter. Book is with them. He's got to be careful. He doesn't get singled out. He's taking so much damage already. The limited one. Oh. Game goes out. They're trying to revenge this one back on there. Nip takes a big chunk of damage. Well, I caught out with the dark mind. He has to get away. So much damage coming towards him. Wicked comes in. They turn it back around. Young Book gets the kill towards him. Hogger goes down. Young Book gets away with it. Now they're going to turn it back around. It's going to be the inhibitor zone finally going down. This is a wild, wild game. But just the power alliance is thinking of. Airwax is giving chase. He's going to have to be the hero. Young Buck coming around the side as well. That's going to be two down. And Young Buck's going to get himself another one. Double kill. And it's an A for the Copenhagen one. He's going to go straight down the middle. This might be an inhibitor Tori, but they're going to have to fight as well. Tori's already going to be down by the time the Lions actually get away. The Copenhagen one's going to keep going. They do decide to go in. Airwax is going to kick Wicked into the middle of the team. He's right in the middle of them. But well, Young Buck, don't ride in. And he's going to get shut down. That's real bad news as the cocoon comes down. Countdown going to go low. Tab's been forced out of the fight, though, as Countdown comes back into it. Trying to chase down onto Shuck. They do manage to get the kill, but there's still three to go. Fantastic control, but the Wolves are going to get on towards one. That's a double kill for Walleye now. That's Shuck and Diff going down, and the Wolves are pushing on towards the inhibitor. You can see Froggen coming around the side. Spear threading through could be enough to take someone down. It's going to catch on. Oh, and oh the unbreakable. I'm not sure if he'll stop eating in there, but there wasn't quite enough damage. Frogger jumps in, they jump back on to one Frogger! Frogger goes down! And now the Baron is a possibility for the Wolves. They are really low on hit points, but they're going to make a play for it. They could end up dying to Baron, though. No, that's the problem here. Oh, he stepped on a trap! He stood on he a trap! He stepped on Frogger's trap! <laughs> what a way to die in the end, after all that one. Sneak a little oh! Coming in, Jesus! And Airwax desperately trying to get in there. He wants to separate someone. Thought about it. He's gonna have to back away. The cover being used. That's gonna get blocked off by Unbreakable from Unlimited. There. They try and turn it around. The dark finally goes in. This is a dangerous play. There's gonna be chunk of waters on towards Chuck. They're gonna get on towards it. Tap takes down. Airwax straight away. Finally getting on towards another kill. Countdown definitely running away, but Tap is cleaning up right now. With all like tries to get back up. Wicked should be able to get the slow, and he's gonna heal himself up. The speed on there. The spear's gone through. Wicked flashes on towards him, and he sneaks across to the side. But it doesn't matter. Alliance are running for the base. Oh, he's going back. To oh, no, he's gonna try and one v one. They kill each other. They kill each other, and that four men down. Young Buck's got and heal, so he may stick around if he gets caught by the knockout of Cabochon. He's in trouble. He's gonna get caught out, he's gonna get in towards it. Intervention goes down from Overpower, locks on towards him. Lonex gets on towards Salamar's not gonna be focused. Overpower will! Oh, wow. one and one! And shot. Oh my god! Overpower gets two down! Salamar clears it out! Wow! Tower here, so very smart move by Alliance. And Froggen now going on to Source. So as gonna get locked up, Cyanide's gonna join him. So Froggen gonna get baited into this one. Look at this though. Top and middle lane, both being pushed. Sorry, the bottom lane. Alliance shoving in towards. That's gonna be an inner turret going down. Five members of Alliance pushing in. For now, Tinker have to back away. They can't push on towards it too long, or they're gonna lose this inhibitor turret. So is his doing what he it. can. He can't drag this descent. He can't do anything on towards it. That's an inhibitor turret going down. They're gonna kill so through. Second loud. Yellow Star comes back in. Respawns goes back down again. It's the inner. Alliance in keeps on pushing. What? Meanwhile, in the bottom lane, you can see Reckless. He's on the inhibitor turret as well. He's keeping on down towards that. Froggen catches down Soas. The Destiny comes around. Cyanide's going to come around the side here. They're going to keep on pushing. We can see in the finish. bottom corner. That's the inhibitor turret going down. Alliance to keep on pushing. The inhibitor turrets are dropping. They're going to keep on shoving through. And Fnatic have to back away desperately. But that's the second Nexus turret going down. They're on to the Nexus. Can they finish the game the right Nexus. A 23 minute game. It's the Nexus. Alliance, they're going to get blocked off. They can't finish it, can they? One more hit. They've got it! Alliance take down Fnatic in 23 minutes! Tactical oh, problem from Fnatic, you have to wonder! Five minutes! ...in this bottom lane can just join in any time. Copenhagen Wolves though, they want to fight. Yeah, Destiny was used there to get the vision and selfie. Gonna get knocked up in the air. There's a lot of damage coming through. Yarrow is gonna fall. Mima now the next target. He flashes away though, but Mr. Rawls caught alone at the back. He will be finished off and the shutdown goes to Kautard. And now it's all on Impaler running north. Mima will run all alone down towards the south side of the...